This is a disproof by counterexample question taken from a MedExcel textbook. Two parts to the question. Um, so a student is trying to prove that 1 plus x squared is less than 1 plus x all being squared. And the student writes 1 plus x being squared is equal to this once expanded. So 1 plus x squared is less than 1 plus 2x plus x squared. So we're asked to identify the error made in the proof and then provide a counterexample to show that the statement is not true. Okay, so let's have a look at what the student writes. So let's start with the first line. 1 plus x being squared is equal to 1 plus x multiplied by itself. And if I expand that in the usual way, I'll get um, a 1, 2x terms and an x squared simplifying to 1 plus 2x plus x squared. So that's okay, nothing wrong with that first line. Now, I'm assuming then that what the student is trying to do is um, find an expression for um, this right hand side, sorry. So he's then concluded that 1 plus x squared, because it says so here, um, is less than 1 plus 2x plus x squared. So the first problem there is that the student has assumed that that original expression is true, found an expansion for the 1 plus x being squared, and then concluded that the slightly different format of that quadratic, uh, it, uh, inserted into that inequality, will also be true. So his, that's a problem. So one problem is... <coughs> The student has assumed that the original expression is true. So original inequality is true. Whereas he's supposed to be, or he or she, they are supposed to be showing that that, that inequality is true. But I think what the question is actually trying to get at is that if we're looking at this, we've got a 1 plus x squared and then 1 plus x squared also on the right-hand side, but with this additional 2x. Okay, so just let's have a look from that perspective. So is it true that 1 plus x squared is less than 1 plus 2x plus x squared? Um, it is true if 2x is positive. So if I add, so if I have one plus x squared on the left, one plus x squared um, on the right, with an additional positive term, of course that inequality is going to be true because the right hand side will be larger. However, we cannot assume that two um, x is positive or even the x is positive. So I think that might be what the the um, the question is getting at here, with the assumption that x is positive. So another problem is assumption that x is positive. Okay, but it's arguable that the, the problem in that um, first part of the question there is the assumption that the original inequality was true. Okay, in part b then, provide a counterexample to show that the statement is not true. All we have to do then is choose any x that isn't positive. I'll go for a very simple x equals minus 1, uh, 1 plus minus 1 squared um, uh, is equal to 2 and um, 1 plus 2 lots of minus 1 plus minus 1 squared um, is 0 and it's certainly not true that 2 is less than 0 so we found a counterexample where that's true and any negative x value will work there and that completes the question. So um, check out studyworld.com for more proof examples.